The United States has formally told the Syrian government that U.S. powers are currently involving Syria until the point when additionally take note. Prior this week, the U.S. issued a dispatch to the Syrian and Russian coalition, illuminating them that dynamic obligation staff, for example, special forces powers, counselors, coaches, mechanics, and supporting units will remain for all time positioned in Syria. They additionally reaffirm that their no-fly zone will be entirely upheld by shooting down any planes that fly over Syrian airspace. Post Russ reports, U.S. Commander of American Powers in Iraq and Syria Lt. Gen. Stephen Townshend expressed, We've educated the Russians where we're at, they, let us know they've educated the Syrians, and I'd simply say that we will safeguard ourselves in the event that we feel debilitated. Since. As Reuters reports, conflicts amongst Kurdish and Syrian powers have heightened. Various investigators beforehand waged that the U.S. would take this course given the achievement of the Syrian and unified Russian battle as a rule and specifically in light of souring U.S.-Turkish relations, the likelihood of the U.S. losing access to the Turkish and Cyrillic base, and the desperate circumstance of Takfiri powers squatted in Alo. Distinctive universal news organizations have just run a form of the story which displays the U.S. powers report as a notice for Russia and Syria, CNN, or a protective risk, IBT, however they have neglected to recognize the true significance of this improvement. Nor have they incorporated that the U.S. military's legitimate proclamation is in stark infringement of worldwide law, constituting an unlawful control of a sovereign state. It has for some time been surveyed that the reason that the U.S. had all the while upheld ISIS and Kurdish powers was with the end goal of utilizing ISIS as a placeholder to be crushed, either for all intents and purposes or in reality, just to then cut out the U.S. occupation zone under the appearance of framing an autonomous Kurdish state. Already a year ago, delegates of the Kurdish self-governing local made an illegal and one-sided declaration of federalization. This turn was utilized to make an apparently lawful equivocalness, or hazy area, to confound open talk at the media level. Notwithstanding, the counter-psychological oppressor coalitions outside priests and in addition universal lawful specialists are under no hallucinations that the one-sided assertion of federalization is the same amount of an infringement of Syrian sway as would be a breakaway republic made conceivable just because of a war of U.S. occupation. Under the global legitimate standards of the Geneva tradition and in addition consequent parallel ascensions, a remote possessing nation does not have the privilege to isolate, partition, involve, or cut out an area of a nation paying little heed to what the possessing armed force terms, for example. In addition, the latest dispatch from the U.S. Lieutenant General Townshend in northern Syria laid out plans to build the zone of what the U.S. considers Kurdistan. Under the present Syrian constitution, Kurds are spoken to both in the administration in Damascus and have a semi-independent status inside the focal Syrian state. A noteworthy impact course The shameless and illicit notices issued by the U.S. officer represent the genuine probability of making a head-on encounter between Syrian, Iranian, Russian, and other free powers from one perspective, and the U.S. military and their Kurdish mannequin equips on the other. This sensational increment in dangers would bargain a noteworthy hit to seeks after a conciliatory determination to the emergency. In 2011, the U.S., close by its Israeli, Turkish, Qatari, and Saudi partners and with help from Jordan, sorted out, supported, and financed the dispatch of an illicit attack by non-formally dressed consistent warriors, hired soldiers, youngster troopers, and equipped religious enthusiasts huge numbers of whom themselves were delivered into the locale from Europe where they have legitimate home. A 2011 dissent development which had bloomed out of the endeavors of the U.S. National Endowment for Democracy and UN-authorized NGOs financed by the House of Saud and Qatari government exploited Syria's liberal and open society, invading metro associations and controlling Syria's mainstream pluralism against itself. This made the likelihood for a media simulacrum in which universal eyewitnesses and media, both purposefully and accidentally, conflated a challenged development included for the most part of Syrians with a military operation which rapidly turned out to be simply an outside intrusion.
Russian inclusion upon the welcome of the True Blue administration of Syria was the wellspring of a genuine difficulty to U.S. points in the area. Presently what stays to be seen is the thing that the U.S. is really arranged to do. Syrian and Russian military organizers no uncertainty long prior gamed out numerous situations and built up some sort of responsive emergency courses of action. It is just normal that, while such responsive plans exist, they would not involve open exposure. At issue is the limit of the U.S., and once worldwide hegemon which geostrategic examiners around the globe have surveyed to now be in a melting away stage, to keep up a word related a dependable balance in the Kurdish locale of Syria. Both Syria and Turkey may find that they have a typical enthusiasm for contradicting the U.S. manic and Kurdish state. Before the flare-up of the present clash, Syria and Turkey kept up a settlement which permitted Turkish security powers to seek after Kurdish separatist fear-based oppressors who might on occasion escape to Syria from operations in Turkey. After the contention started, both Syria, and Turkey and the United States, to the degree to which the last two can be considered to have disparate interests, all occupied with the session of playing the Kurdish card. Each side in the contention would have liked to have the capacity to utilize the help of equipped Kurdish gatherings to their own particular closures. While there is much data that proposes that Turkey is reorienting itself far from Euro-Atlanticism and NATO, particularly in light of Turkey's moves amid and after the fizzled upset endeavor, there is dependably the likelihood that current Turkish moves are quite of a long haul and tend to cast an apparition of vulnerability over Turkey's tentative arrangements working together with the U.S. Such would not in any manner be remarkable ever. Taking everything into account, the U.S. declaration denotes a defining moment in this contention. In the event that before there had been any uncertainty about the U.S. goals in Syria, an arrangement to isolate Syria which had been openly expounded in various Aislandicist think tank distributions, for example, those of the Brookings Institute or Council on Foreign Relations, then now the U.S. has uncovered its hand. This is a memorable and perilous advancement which just expands the odds of aggregate war.